For more than a decade, the SOHO mission has provided great insights into our sun, its dark spots, massive flares, and the quakes on the surface which betray the inner composition. Astronomers have been eager to extend its pioneering techniques to other stars. The Coral spacecraft, standing for convection rotation and planetary transits, will learn much more about the interior of stars, and it will be breaking new ground in the search for distant worlds outside our solar system. Since the discovery in 1995 of the first extrasolar planet, more than 200 have been identified using ground-based telescopes. The planets that we've found so far are, are gas giants, more akin to Jupiter in our system. Koro is the first space mission, or the first mission ever, that is looking for planets like our own Earth. The 360 kilogram satellite, launched by a Soyuz rocket from the Baikonur Cosmodrome, will be placed in a polar orbit at an altitude of some 850 kilometers. It carries a telescope with a 30 centimeter primary mirror focusing on a two-part camera and will alternately observe opposite regions of the sky starting with the Orion constellation. We will remain on this target until we have been traveling around the sun with, together with the Earth uh, so that the sunlight starts penetrating into the telescope. After that we will turn 180 degrees and look in exactly the opposite direction towards the direction of the galactic center, as it were, uh, and continue observing there for 150 days. And we will continue and do this, building up a, a stellar catalog of hundreds of thousands of stars that we will have observed, where we hopefully will find lots of nice planets. The telescope